Hello, my fellow friendship graduates of 2020. Who would have thought a few months ago that our graduation ceremony would be this way? On the bright side, we will always be remembered as the graduating class of 2020 that didn't get a graduation. And I'm sure that our 2024 high school graduation will be planned better and be more special because of this. Although our graduation plans went awry, I'm grateful that we even get to do one virtually with just our school. I'm sure you staring at a screen watching me talk to you right now is very different than what we all wanted, but let's try to make the best of it. I would like to start by thanking the teachers and the parents for pushing us so hard and expecting a lot from us, knowing that by putting in hard work, we can achieve greatness. They were always there for us, to motivate us, to inspire us, and to push us hard. They praised us when we needed praise, corrected us when we needed correction, and supported us when we needed an extra push. They transitioned so smoothly into teaching us remotely, and although remote learning wasn't easy for us as students, it was probably so much harder for them to continue educating their students and keeping up with their responsibilities at home. I have made some extremely special connections with some of my teachers over the years that I truly treasure, and you know who you are. Thank you for shaping me into the student I am today and into the professional I will someday be. I know that whatever I will become, it will be in part thanks to you. I feel so blessed to graduate from Friendship Junior High. There are so many opportunities that we have been offered these past three years. Sports, music, clubs, musicals, the AR program, and many other extracurricular activities. I have a few friends that live in Chicago, and through the years, they were many times surprised to hear about all the games, concerts, and plays that I was a part of. Their schools did not offer most of these things. Most of us probably took for granted all these things, but I tell you, these were opportunities that not many students our age have. Friendship Junior High has, set up, has a set of staff like no other. If it weren't for them, we would not have all the after-school activities that Friendship has now. So a sincere thank you to all of the teachers who coached a team, sponsored a club, or took extra time out of their school hours to help us do what we are interested in and love. I will say that middle school is the most difficult time for many students. While high school and college may be filled with exams and hard courses, middle school is a time of discovering who we are and who we want to be. When I walked into Friendship Junior High on my first day of sixth grade, I knew it would be different than how things were done at Frost but I didn't think the change would be so drastic. So to be a little more positive, I said there are only four quarters left until the end of the school year. And hey, only 12 quarters left until I graduate. And now as a graduate of Friendship Junior High, looking back at that first day of sixth grade, I can truly say that during my 12 quarters at this school, I found out who I want to be. This time in junior high gave us a chance to begin finding out what sports we like, what we like to learn, which classes bring us joy, and what kind of people we like to be surrounded by. From the popular girl that everyone knows and everyone loves to the quiet girl that never speaks out. And from the boy that makes every team and is known throughout the school to the quiet one that no one seems to notice. I wanna tell you that you have value and you have worth. You are important. You don't have to fit in with everyone. You don't have to be like everyone. You don't have to wear those clothes and have that hairstyle. You just have to be content with who you are and who you want to become. I know that nothing I say or do will make up for what we missed out on because of this pandemic. I am just as disappointed as all of you are. This was supposed to be the best time of the junior high years, the end of the eighth grade year. From making tie-dye t-shirts, going to Six Flags, having our breakfast on the last day of school and signing yearbooks, to walking down the aisle at Elk Grove High School on that Tuesday night and being handed our diplomas on stage, feeling that sense of pride for finishing our time at Friendship Junior High strong. I know we were all excited to get on the bus with our friends and head back to our school one last time for our graduation dance. We all knew what was to come. Tons of pictures and final memories with the people we have spent the last three years with. We would get a chance to say goodbye to the teachers and to the ones that would attend a different high school. But our plans changed. Instead of talking to all of you on stage at the high school, it is done on the screen. Instead of a final dance at Friendship, it was made virtually for all three junior highs and it was nothing like what we wanted or expected. It's hard to think about this factor that we didn't get a last goodbye. But let us show our future high schools that this hardship has made us stronger as people and as students. And most importantly, it has kept us healthy. 
I would also like to thank Mr. Timmons, Mr. Verbeck, and Mrs. Osterman for putting up with me and all the pro projects I had in mind this year. From the home-based competitions to snacks being sold at games, friendship bracelets, and the hallway mirror project, my personal favorite, they have allowed me to spread my wings as president and didn't stay in my way. There, were, there was more to be accomplished until the end of the school year with the help of and support of my fellow officers and the student senate, but the unexpected happened. The last thing I would like to say to the students is to make friendship proud. Some of us are going to Prospect, many are going to Elk Grove, and some are going to Rolling Meadows. Whichever high school we will be attending in the fall, let's be proud that we are from friendship. Let's be the students that others look up to, the ones that teachers ask, what junior high did they go to? And proudly will say friendship. Thank you, friendship, for everything you have done for us. Stay strong, everyone. Stay healthy. Take pride in how far you have come and have faith in how far you can go. Thank you and God bless you.